Hello and welcome to the BS Academy. So recently IIT Bombay has changed their syllabus a little bit to the each branches. So according to the new syllabus, uh, we have made these charts in our best possible ways and these charts basically give you an idea how to prepare your own charts because ultimately you have to make your own charts of every subject and after that you will get that confidence. So basically these charts will give you the ideas and perfect information after referring all the reference books. Now this is the 10th subject of the GATE Mechanical 2021. The name of the subject is Engineering Mechanics. This is the final subject of our short notes as well as the syllabus of the GATE Mechanical 2021. So let's begin one by one. Here in the starting, let's see one example which is very simple but very useful in the examination. If a block is at rest and the force is applied of 10 Newton, then find the friction. Here F max is equal to mu s into n, but here the F max is equal to 30 Newton. But the condition is P should less than or equal to mu s into n. So here in the example, the value of P which is given as 10 Newton is less than that of F max. So at P which is equal to 10 Newton, the block starts to move. Then after the Lamis theorem is there, A upon sine alpha is equal to B upon sine beta is equal to C upon sine theta. Then it is also known as the sine law. Then after the next one is the cosine law. A square is equal to B square plus C square minus 2BC cos alpha. Then after the parallelogram law, R square is equal to B square plus Q square plus 2 into BQ cos theta. And then alpha is equal to Q sin theta divided by P plus Q cos theta. Then after very known theorem, it states that the moment of a force about a point is same as the vector addition of the moments of components of force about the same point. Then the tension is always away from the point inside the body. Then after some equations which are useful, T1 by T2 is equal to E dash to mu theta. Here T1 is equal to tight side and T2 is equal to slack side. Then theta is equal to contact angle and phi is equal to 10 inverse mu. Then after some more important equations which are basics but you just have to go through it once. V square is equal to u square plus 2s then s is equal to ut plus half t square and s is equal to t by 2 into u plus v then sigma f is equal to ma. Similarly that of the omega f square is equal to omega naught square plus 2 into alpha theta then omega f is equal to omega naught plus alpha t then theta is equal to omega naught t plus half into alpha t square and theta is equal to t by 2 into omega t plus omega naught then sigma t is equal to i into alpha then h max is equal to u square into sin square theta divided by 2g then t is equal to 2u by g then capital t is equal to 2u into sin theta by g then h max is equal to u square by 2g and v is equal to under root 2gh r is equal to u square into sin 2 theta by g then r max is equal to u square by g then time to reach the top t is equal to u by g then total flight time t is equal to 2 u by g then h star is equal to h bar plus i g into h bar then h star is equal to h bar plus i g sin square theta by a h bar and i g is equal to i naught minus a h square then for capital letter i theta is less than 90 degree h is equal to 4 sigma cos theta by rho g d then h is equal to minus 4 sigma cos theta by rho g d for capillary 4 and theta greater than 180 degree then here a t is equal to r into alpha and a n is equal to omega square into r here a t and a n are the accelerations then after a is equal to under root n square plus a t square here a n is equal to g into cos alpha or g into cos beta and a t is equal to g into sin alpha or g into sin beta then after for rolling without slipping a is equal to 2 by 3 into g sin theta for cylinder 
and a is equal to 5 by 7 into g sin theta 4 sphere then for slipping without rolling a is equal to g into sin theta which is same for the cylinder and sphere then after for linear rolling here first equation for the sphere f is equal to 2 by 5 into ma and a is equal to 5 by 7 into p by m then f is equal to 2 by 7 into p then for cylinder a is equal to 2 by 3 into p by m then f is equal to p by 3 and f is equal to m by 2 into at here at is equal to r alpha then here coefficient of restitution first one is the elastic impact e is equal to 1 then vt minus v1 is equal to u1 minus u2 then e is equal to v2 minus v1 divided by u1 minus u2 then for plastic impact e is equal to 0 so v2 is equal to v1 then here if a ball drops from the top to ground then the equation of distance traveled by the ball before coming to rest d is equal to h into 1 plus e square divided by 1 minus e square and if ball thrown upward from the ground then distance traveled by the ball before coming to rest is d is equal to 2 into h upon 1 minus e square then after the important concept from the engineering mechanics which is truss if 2j is equal to m plus 3 then the determinant or perfect or stable structure is there then if 2j is greater than m plus 3 then unstable structure is there and if 2j less than m plus 3 then indeterminate or or stable structure is there here j is equal to the number of joint and m is equal to number of links so there are two examples for the structure here in the first one m is equal to 4 and j is equal to 4 then by equation value of 2j is greater than that of the m plus 3 so the structure is unstable and in the second one m is equal to 8 and j is equal to 5 so here the overstable stable structure is there then there are three more examples from the truss here you can take a screenshot if you want in the first one use the sine law and in the second one you have to find the RAC and RAB and in the third one you have to find the value of RBC this is all about the subject engineering mechanics from which we have completed only the important formulas and the links for the complete short notes of all the subject of mechanical engineering which are in the description box you can check out any subject from the description box if you like this video please do like and subscribe to the bs academy channel and please share these short notes to all your other friends who is preparing for the gate examination Thank you so much.